Peek-a-boo. Hey, welcome back to another Family Home Evening video. This one's gonna be really weird because I happen to be filming at 10.41. So, whenever I film this late, weird things tend to happen. Uh, but it's all gonna be good because you're learning from me, right? So, let's roll the first skit. Many eons ago. Please never do! Don't say that, Joe! I can't do it! Dude, I'm totally gonna throw you in jail. After all, that's where you belong. Monsters go in jail, didn't you know the law, dude? Come on, I'm totally gonna put you there. No! Yeah, and who's gonna stop me? What are you doing, sir, for them? Are you trying to kill us as puppets? Well, you know what I'll do to you, sir, for them? If you kill us as puppets, I will come in with my razor and I will shave those sunglasses right off of your face! Not my sunglasses! I can't lose my sunglasses! Fine! I'll let him go home! Yo, dudes! I'm like actually a good person now! It's totally tubular! And it's all thanks to that strange man with the razor! I don't even know his name, but I'm so excited that he exists! It's brilliant! Whoever would have thought that Server Dave was once such a bad guy? Huh. Well, anyway. If you couldn't tell, that skit was meant to show that even people who are really weird and really evil, <clears throat> like Surfer Dave, they can change. Like, Surfer Dave, he was totally gonna kill that puppet and like send him to jail and whatever, but he was saved. So this goes hand in hand with the scripture story from this week, which is about how the Apostle Paul was once Saul. So what happened in the story is that the Lord sent the prophet Aeneas to go visit Saul, Saul was a Pharisee who was known for being really evil and persecuting the church and killing apostles and stuff like that. So Aeneas really did not want to go because he was like, ah, uh, this Saul guy is pretty sketchy and he's gonna kill me. Uh, I'll just, you know, not go. But Aeneas went and gave Saul a blessing. Unlike other prophets that we might know of who said no when they were scared. Now I know I'm probably boring you to death right now. So, all related to pop culture as well. In Star Wars, Darth Vader is Anakin Skywalker, and Anakin is a good guy. And then Emperor Palpatine, aka Darth Sidious, turns him into a bad guy. But Darth Vader, aka Anakin Skywalker, does become a good guy, sort of, again. Darth Vader kills Emperor Palpatine and is able to transition and become a good person in the last few seconds of his life and go back to the light side, of course. Paul does not die immediately after he becomes Paul. But it does show that redemption truly is possible for anyone. Even if you might think you're such a bad person, and you aren't, you're definitely not doing anything as bad as what Saul was doing, or what Darth Vader was doing. So, you really don't need to worry about being redeemed in that way, but through the atonement of Jesus Christ, everyone will be saved. But we do need to take a step in our own time to become better people. So the moral of the story today is to be a good person. Even if there are mistakes that you've made in your life that you wish you could go back on, or you want to change things about yourself, people can change. This change for Saul was huge. He was a bad person. Aeneas, through the power of the Lord, helped him to become a good person. In Star Wars, Anakin changed completely when he became Darth Vader. He changed completely again, just before his death. I'll not leave you here, I've got to save you. You already have. Change is possible, if we trust in the Lord. The Lord will never let us down, no matter what. People can change. People can change. People can change. Oh, people can change. People can change. People can change. People can change. Oh, people can change. People can change. People can change. People can change. Oh, people can change. People can change. People can change. People can change. Oh, people can change. People can change. People can change. People can change. Oh, people can change. People can change. People can change.
Yeah. So this goes hand in hand. <laughs> <laughs>